Hi my loves, welcome back to the Star's Cartel channel. If you don't know, I am Star. The message I heard is all night long. The scripture comes from 2 Maccabees 4.43. Charges about this affair were brought against Menelaus when the king came to Tyre. Three men sent by the Senate presented to him the justice of their cause. But Menelaus, seeing himself on the losing side, promised Ptolemy, son of Zorimenes, a substantial sum of money if he would win the king over. So Ptolemy retired with the king under a colonnade as if to get some fresh air and persuaded him to change his mind. Menelaus, who was the cause of all the trouble, the king's acquitted the king acquitted of the charges while he condemned to death those four men who would have been declared innocent even if they had pleaded their case before Scythians. Thus, those who had prosecuted the case for the city, for the people, and for the sacred vessels quickly suffered unjust punishment. For this reason, even some of the Tyrians were indignant over the crime and provided sumptuously for their burial. But Menelaus, thanks to the covetous of the men in power remained in office when he grew in wickedness and became the chief plotter against his fellow citizens okay so this is a message for somebody um god is saying there is somebody that you know they are evil you know they plot evil you know that they are the cause for a lot of problems you know that they cause a lot of issues you know that they cause a lot of bad things to happen but you insist on helping this person you insist you are persistent on um getting this person out of trouble okay you are persistent on backing this person up you are persistent on making it out to seem as though this person is a good person and god is saying if you continue to do this just as in this scripture those who prosecuted the case for the city, for the people, and for the sacred vessels quickly suffered unjust punishment. You will receive the punishment that this person is supposed to receive. God is saying he is going to hand out their punishment to you because you know that they are wrong. And instead of accepting the fact that they are wrong, you insist on trying to make it seem as though they're good and they're not. God is saying, be careful. Be careful, be careful, and choose wisely because this person, they will carry on. Um, it says that he remained in office where he grew in wickedness and became the chief plotter against his fellow citizens. This person is never going to change. This is somebody that wake up to be evil. They wake up to do evil. They wake up to cause problems. They wake up to, uh, to cause drama. They always want some kind of drama going on. And you helping them is not helping like they probably don't even want your help in a sense like this is the only reason they're coming to you for help is because they know that you can get them out of what they put themselves into 333 three, three. but in reality they're not gonna do nothing but turn around and go right back to the same bs that they just that you just got them out of um be careful because like this is a warning to somebody god said he gonna be on your head all night long if you continue to help this person after he told you to stop that's the message um thank you guys for watching and god is saying that he's not saying that you can't help anybody that's not the point the point is you are helping somebody to do evil you are helping somebody and they are seeking to do evil. They are seeking to do wrong. They are seeking to do bad. Yes, God wants you to help other people. Yes, God wants you to care about other people. Yes, God wants you to be, you know, a good um, Christian, to be sincere, to be loving, and to be kind. But the way that you are going about things, you know that this person don't mean no good. And you are helping them anyways. They don't mean no good. They, don't, they probably don't even mean, I hear God saying they don't even mean good to you because you are going to end up in the crossfire of whatever it is you're helping them to do. And that's the message. Thank you guys for watching. Be sure to like, share, and subscribe.